The plot twist at the end of the last one was not really how things were supposed to go, so apparently I have a long, boring, pantsless drive to make on my own. I've had plenty of time to think about things and to run into walls because I'm an idiot. Oh, I hate birds so much in this game. Really, really, truly do. Oh, I didn't bring any anything to heal myself with. Okay, that's handy. And I know where I went wrong. Like, there's there's no question of that. I, I died for hubris. I mean, it pretty much is that simple. And so here we are, once again, hubrising it up. Didn't bring anything to help other than a spear and uh, some intestinal fortitude. That's most everything. That's good, I guess. Wow, this is just a mess. Like, I don't even know where to begin with all this stuff. It's, it's just a mess. There's crap everywhere. You really need to be sorted and stuff here. We need to wear some of these things, too. It's funny, I had had the thought, and I, I kind of... I don't know where I stand on this. Uh, I guess that one, since it has the pocket, I don't know, whatever. After dying, I had the thought, and I kind of wished that maybe this had been... Man, which one's which? Here, that one. Okay, so let's move that one to that one. I kind of wish this had been an Iron Man run, or a, a hardcore run, or... One life to live, no respawn. I don't know, whatever you want to refer to it as. I just, in hindsight, I kind of wish that I had done that. But here we are. Didn't do that. So it is what it is, and that's just fine. All these things that we brought to recover all of this stuff, not really necessary at this point. This one just straight up failed, so I guess we can... Uh, well, it is gone, so we don't have to do anything with it. All right, that's fine. There should be multiple vehicles around here, if I'm not mistaken. Though I'm not sure that they're all going to show up on the on the thing now. I don't even know which ones they would be. There's, I know, a mini bike over here, and I guess a proper motorcycle. Is that what we're using? I don't honestly remember at this point. <laughs> How bad is that? I've had a week. Let me just say that I've had a week. I seem to say that a lot, but it doesn't make it any less true. Okay, so we're over here. Do you have any... Uh, you don't have any mods on you, so then we can just straight up... Oh, I must have put... In, put in, I must have put in stuff on it. I must have put stuff in it. That's right, I put fuel in there because I wasn't sure if we would need any more to get back. So that means we can just kind of throw some of this stuff in here that we don't need to be carrying around like crazy town every everywhere we go. We've got a bajillion things. Should probably use one of these now that I'm thinking about it. Let's do that. Just to, uh, you know, be safe and stuff. Got all these notes. We don't need these guys right now. And then I guess we don't need a bunch of these other things. Oh my gosh. Let me just meet you somewhere else, because this is going to take a minute. Finish out the thought. I do, as I said, I kind of wish I had done something to make this a little more uh, hardcore-y or something. I really admire you, uh, Sure, we'll just do that one. That's fine. I don't think we have anything we need to sell, and we're not going to buy anything, so that's fine. We'll get out of here. But just the same, we're going to continue on. I mean, you know, just run with that one death. I just, I don't know, I, I guess I've kind of gotten to the point where if I die, I feel like I just need to start over. It's as much an excuse to just enjoy the early game as anything else, because really, the early game is the best part of this game. By the time you get to where we're at now, I mean, and this isn't even that far. This is day 18, so this is kind of hilarious. Day 18 with no guns, by the way. That's the really hilarious part about it to me. Like, I don't know if we've been to this store. I think we have to double loot it. 
just for what we're doing. So I don't know. It just it's uh, it's one of those things. What can I say? I just I'm a little weird. I have particular ways I like to play and things I'm trying to accomplish and stories I'm trying to tell and I don't know. I mean, I guess it's neither here nor there. It just it is what it is. I've died before. I will die again in this game. It's definitely not the first time. Not going to be the last time. So it's no real concern from that standpoint. It's just, I don't know, I kind of like the idea of having that clean start. And I've always kind of enjoyed playing the hardcore game. I don't know why. I guess it, it it's a little bit of role playing from the standpoint of, you know, actually surviving in this crazy world. I don't know, I just kind of dig it. It's fun to me. How's the time on sprockets when you dance? So, just keep doing that. Hi. I was trying to ignore you long enough to deal with your friend. You guys aren't really helping here. Okay. Are we good? Because I'm doing all sorts of bleeding and stuff, and that, that really was not in the plans for today. I mean, I figured it was pretty good chance depending on on how things went but you know whatever it's cool uh, i guess we'll take those i don't know i'm not really sure what to do with them sell them i guess uh sure i guess we'll we'll sell those too i don't know what are we even doing here we're doing a fetch quest is that right we're doing a fetch quest okay so all i really care about right now i think is just to unlock these boxes here and see what we have. I don't think we have any explosives, do we? I didn't think to grab any of those. I mean, grabbed, like, pipe bombs and that sort of thing, thinking that there might be a lot to... a lot of zombies to blow up, but I wasn't thinking about blowing up boxes. My bad. We'll start with this one just because I spent all the time opening it, so might as well. I guess we do have a jailbreaker. So there's that. Uh, you know what? I don't even want the ammo. I'm really trying not to collect this stuff. I guess we'll take the bandolier mod because we can sell that. Put it on something to sell, I guess. I don't know. Whatever. Yes, go ahead and start the music for that one zombie. Come on, Savage Country Box. Uh, we will take that ammo because that's the only one that we will ever have use of. Potentially. And even then, there's no guarantee because the way this has been going... It's not been going according to my plan, I'll tell you that much. Let's go ahead and reset this place. We can we can do that now, we're fine. This will be a fetch quest, so nice and easy, in and out. Grab whatever it is we're looking for, call it good. Uh, let's make sure we have arrows selected that maybe are a little closer to what we want to be using. Because I suspect there will be a few of these zombies we need to get rid of. Like so. Yeah, let's just go ahead and take out this guy. Just take the free experience right there. Nice and easy. And then I did want to drop off a couple more things, because we really don't need to be carrying lots of this stuff. Uh, here, let's drop off all those guys. Actually, that too, because we'll just add the mod to it before we sell it. That's fine. That's, that's all good. So that's probably good enough. Here, we'll put all those things in there too. We'll keep the one sewing kit just in case we need it don't anticipate needing it but good golly you never know and yeah i know there there were other things that i did not check doing the double loot and that's totally okay that really wasn't the point i mean not a full double loot don't don't get me wrong just partial that was the point you seem to be missing an arm okay Go ahead and crack open this guy then, just for the giggles. There are a lot of zombies trying to uh, get over here, I guess. I don't know. Ah, sure, we'll take a Steel Reaper Spear. Why not? That guy was really excited to get over here. Much more excited than his friend. Yeah, I, I was thinking, I bet a bunch of them are, are actually outside. And that's what it looks like. A bunch of them are outside. That's cool. They'll come in eventually, and then we'll have to deal with them, and it'll be... It'll be jolly good time. You just need to burn... Burn away for all your zombie sins. Oh, 
Not even paying attention to stamina at all. Just swinging. So far, so good. Okay. I think we have done good work here. We are done. We can now leave. We have done everything. Sort of. How you doing down there? Oh. I think I swept the leg. Pretty sure that's exactly what that was. Wakes for me. Let's go up here. And we are going to have some fun zombies up in the the ceiling here. The roof area. The ceiling? The ceiling. We'll call it the ceiling. The drop ceiling. So we're going to have some ceiling zeds to deal with, I... I believe. Uh, is this the way we just came from? Nah. It is the way to go. Now, that's just to get the final loot, because really we need to go that way to get the supplies we're supposed to retrieve. But since supplies are underrated, overrated, whatever, we don't care about those things, and instead, we are here to get the zombies to come burst out and say hello. Oh, you are dead. Okay, great. I don't know why you're crawling, and you're just... Okay. That one was really weird. Hi, is there anyone else over here? You're not going to get through for a while, so you can be ignored, good sir. I'll just crack open all these things. I'd had the thought of taking the, the vitamins that we have just for the giggles, and I thought, who cares? We're past the point that it matters, so just, uh, just roll with it. Just roll with it, baby. Oh my goodness, we're just going to have so much crappy steel armor to sell, aren't we? All the crappy steel armors in the world. We had to walk into the store with all of them. I think that's what happened. Alright, give me a second. I got work to do. Thanks to the magic of non-linear editors, that was about a second, I believe. What do we have here? On this trigger map. Color me bored by that one. I mean, we already have it technically, so it doesn't even matter. Come on. Not what I wanted. I guess we can take that, because we can add that to the ballista stuff to sell. Sure, we'll take all those things. We do have some friends over here that want to say hello. And I'm having trouble hitting them. And we'll just body shot him in the case that it matters. Ah, uh, you know what? I'm going to leave the rest of them. I don't, I don't want to... I just... I don't want to... Go ahead and take that right now, though. And then... We'll... I don't know. I think we already have this map, so... I just don't even care. I'm going to drop that one. Oh, hi. How you doing? We'll take that arrow back, though, if you don't mind. Bad dog. I'm not sure how you got stuck right there, but I'm not going to argue with it because it's convenient for us to do that. For that to be the case, whatever. Words. Words are not my friend today. What can I say? Crowley McCrawlerson, how you doing? Okay, you're another drop ceiling zombie. The infamous drop zed. Gotta love him. Kind of reminds me, on my to-do list is to start making some POIs for Ranger Mod. I actually spent a good chunk of time this week kind of trying to figure out how to use the, the POI editor. Because I've messed with it a little bit, and uh, yeah. You're going to be like right up there, are you? Is that where you are? You're up here somewhere? Are you on the roof roof? Are you like right up... In there. I don't know where it is now. Uh, I think it's on the roof roof, because that distance did not really change. Uh, can you even normally get on the roof in this place? I don't even know. I'm sure you have to be able to, because otherwise... Eh, I guess not. Okay, so it is inside, but it's... At this level? It's right here. I can... I can see where it is. Oh. Crap-a-doodle-doo. 
That's not where that's supposed to be. Oh, my frames then. Want a frame refund. So where is it? Is it up? It's right up there. It's not up in here. Can I not jump up there? I guess I can't. Oh, there's an extra crate right there. I never noticed because I don't ever look up. We don't care about those. I'm pretty sure we dropped them, and if we didn't, we were supposed to, so it's fine. So, can I get up here? And then, I don't even know where it is. It's, like, right over here. Apparently, I don't know where I'm going. It's up in the drop ceiling. And I guess I just don't feel like going up there the normal way. Um... Trash, you gotta move, okay? Because now there's a frame somewhere. I'm stuck in the frame, that's the problem. Ah, oh, goodness. Yeah, I'm literally stuck inside a frame right now. I think I have to exit the game and re-enter for it to not be broken. In hindsight, what I should have done is gone into the debug menu, just turn on god mode, fly through the spot, and then get out, because now I have to reset the stupid... POI and do this again. Which, I mean, I guess that gives us a chance for loot again. But honestly, I don't think I care right now. So instead, we'll do this because we've already gone through this place multiple times. And we'll go ahead and leave. Like, non abusive players or something. I don't know. Honestly, I don't care. Do what you want. If it doesn't hurt anyone else in the game. You can uh, reset things as much as you want. I don't really care. That's up to you. I'm just not feeling like doing that because this is a day where things just feel difficult. And I don't know why that is. We've already checked that one. Okay. But it just... I'm just feeling like everything's a little difficult for me, so... I'm going to try and uh, simplify things as much as possible, which in this case just means grab the stupid package, go to the trader, call it good and try to drive over as many landmines as possible along the way because those are things that are just randomly in the wasteland and it's hilarious when you do it. Didn't find any, that's a shame. Now let's grab all the things that we grabbed to sell. And I guess that's all the things right there because, I don't know, whatever. We could grab Bedlam's Cage just to get a little extra discount. I don't care right now, really don't. We don't... I don't even know. I mean, like, what are we going to do with the money anyway? Buy solar? It's the only thing that's useful at this point. Buying solar and buying steel. And the dog slid down the stairs. That's... that's different. Didn't think that would happen. This looks like the highest quality one. Let us modify you and put on... Sure. Um, and we'll put that one on that one, and then we'll grab this one. Modify you, put on that one, and that one. I think that'll be fine. Here is your reward. All right, what do we get for a reward? Uh, nothing that is actually useful or interesting to us, so we'll, we'll take those. I guess we could take another tier three, because that's the only thing he has that's nearby. Really use some help. And I think because I had to exit the game or something, I don't know, he, he has more to do again, which I guess that's fine. I'm not paying attention to how much money we're getting for these. I'm genuinely not. I'm just getting rid of them. So whatever we made, we made there. And then um, I'll go ahead and sell you that. And you can have that back too, because we don't really care about so many of those things. Oh, you know what? Here. You can have those too. And I think we're good on everything. Um, hello? I think I hit you? No, I did not. Okay. Um. Yeah, I did? Okay, I'm going to say, yeah, I did. Is there anything in here we want? No, not a thing. Good. Let us go! I'm gonna leave the door open because we're gonna be back in two shakes of a rattle take snail, so it's not really gonna take that long to do this mission. I mean, it's a tier three fetch, so it's gonna take longer to break into it than into the final loot chest than it is going to be to do the whole thing, I think. So let's go ahead and run up here and then we can start this guy. 
There we go. Tier 3 quest started. Oh, this one. Okay, we know this one. This is a good one. I do enjoy this one. Let me just bust open the door here. Because I wanted to dodge that. Okay. Now. I wanted to check these guys, because this is the more interesting part of this place to me. Look at that, we got the antibiotics recipe. That's a good one. I like that one. How you doing? You're still just coming on over. Okay. Unlock all the things. Uh, that that door is unlocked now, so it's fine. Here, let's go downstairs. We're kind of going backwards through this place. We're not going in the order you're supposed to. And, uh, yeah. That's good by me. How you doing? Probably should take those vitamins. Not going to worry about it. Going. Keep going through here. I remember how we get through there. It's not as simple as like hitting a button or anything, is it? Yeah, it's definitely not. Because, you know, what remember that. Okay. We got a little bit of dodging to do here. If anyone's having flashbacks to the last episode, you're welcome. That ain't gonna happen today. Not right here, at least. Not to these chuckleheads. They don't even stand a chance. They didn't stand a chance. Oh, look at that. I got a recipe for something that I clicked through and forgot to pay attention to what it was. That's cool. Uh, this is the end location, so where is our thing? It's right there. Literally ran past it. I'm gonna duck. So I hear someone barfing. Okay. Got the thing. How you doing, sir? Yes, this isn't a bad place to go to for the final loot. I mean, just kind of looking what, at what is in here. Not bad. I guess we'll start over here with the bookstore box, just for the giggles. Uh, Forge schematic. Goldenrod seed. Uh, not terribly exciting. Weapons bag. Nothing of interest in there. I'll take those guys. Savage Country box, don't dis... Uh, me. It's fine. That's not bad right there. I'll take all those. SMG schematic is an interesting choice. And... I don't have any weapons to sell, so I'm just going to leave the Hunter mod. I don't remember. I don't think that goes on armor. And if it does... We don't need the money. So, yeah, I'm good with this. I'm fine with that. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Let's get out of here. Where's our motorized conveyance of two wheels and goodness? It's right here. So, right back this way, we will go meet Trader Joel. I don't know. Maybe we'll do one more while we're out here. I'm kind of feeling like, I don't know, I want to go... I want to go somewhere else, I guess. I don't know. I just kind of have had enough of the wasteland for one day, I think. Or maybe what I'm feeling is we should go build something in the wasteland. I don't know. Do you ever have those days where you're not really sure what you want to do? Um, I don't know. I mean, whatever. I can't believe you're giving iron stuff as a reward. I'm kind of insulted, actually. I mean, I guess they're only tier three, so I, I mean, whatever, I don't know. Do you think you can help me? Sure, let's take that one, because that'll be fun. That'll just be a, a smash and bash, and I'm all aboard that. And then we can sell you that, and I think the rest of this stuff is just junk that we can get rid of, whatever. Do you have anything in here? I don't remember what you have to sell, but just thinking maybe you'd have something interesting in here. Doesn't look like it. Although that one, we'll buy that one. I'm okay with that. I'm kind of curious about the night vision goggles, so I haven't played with those in forever. Nope, that is not a completion. Okay. That was my question. We have barely used any food or water. How is that even possible? Didn't eat, didn't drink. I, I'm not sure that's correct. But, okay. 
I mean, whatever. Here, let's drop off those in there. And I guess we can drop that in there, too. Totally forgot to sell the shovel. We can worry about that in a minute. But I do think something might be bugged right now with the food and water. Just as well, because everything else has gone ever so slightly sideways to this point, so... You know. Go ahead and let that go sideways, too, just for the laughs. Works for me. So we're going to be right up at the hardware store, which was like right down the street from the clothing store, if I remember correctly. See, there's your clothing store, and then boom, right here down the street is your hardware store, so... This is where we're coming for this one. Interesting, the little gradual incline and decline right there. Okay. Not sure how I ended up veering way to the left with my aim there, but I guess I did. This is a good old-fashioned clear quest, so we're just going to come in, make some noise, and bash some zombies. How you doing? Oh, he somehow ducked that. Not quite sure how that worked from a physics standpoint, but it's okay. It is what it is. How you doing, sir? I'm gonna shoot you right in the gob. Good times. Not much in here worth looting. Guess we'll check this guy. How you doing? Most of these shells, I'm just not really interested in what's going to be on them, so... Eh, you know. We'll just kind of try and get into the back here and see if we can find anything more interessant going on back here. Oh, look at you. You weren't there before. It's almost like you were trying to surprise me by way of falling out of the ceiling. That would be rude. You wouldn't want to do such a thing now, would you? Look at that. Found a quality three steel something or other. Pickaxe. Meanwhile, the game is busy handing out crappy iron tools as rewards. Thanks, game! You suck! Almost as much as that dog out there does. Aha! Take that, dog! You've been served! Um, I guess we'll take those. We'll leave the cobblestones. We don't really... I don't know, it's only 22. If it had been 222, maybe. Already got that guy. Quality one steel shovel. Yeah, no. Alright. Just load this bad boy up. Oh, wow. I went way faster than I thought. Ow. Oh, that was disappointing. Eh, a little better. I know this is not a proper weapon. Well, well aware of that. I'm specifically trying to launch zombies, so... Leave me alone. Okay. I think we're good. I think we're good. Oh, hi. How you doing? Man, look at the range on this thing. It's fantastic. No zombie's gonna hit you when you're that far away. Well, unless they puke. Oh, look at that. She died to the shock. The shock of all the... manhandling going on here. I'm busy, sir. I'm busy. You're going to have to come back another day when my manager is around and can help you. Because I can't help you. Here, let's check this dropped loot. Um... I guess? I don't know. That seems not at all that helpful to me, but whatever, it's fine. So, I guess we can go and get rid of you. Hello. Eh, vending machine. No worky-worky. Alright, that's cool. Ah, uh, you dog probably came in from that way, so we'll close that door. Let's go over here. And we do need to get a little bit of health pack, so we'll we'll take care of that right quick. Need a splint. Need painkillers. Need a vitamin. I need more than a vitamin. Need a 
Need a honey, need a herbal antibiotic, whatever. Need all the things. Let's just not sweat it right now. Are there birds out here? I don't remember. There is a dog. Which then leads me to believe this is the one that has the bookcase right here. How about that? I remembered a thing. Okay. Um. That guy right there took an arrow to the knee, I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, that looks pretty bad. That looks pretty bad, buddy. What you gonna do about it? You're gonna take one to the ankle, that's what you're gonna do about it. Okay, let's take that back. So this is the way to go, is right here, and this is gonna get us into the drop ceiling. Where things will be totally fine and will sustain much extra damage by way of sprinting when we really shouldn't be. Okay, there's at least one other zombie around, aside from the one that just fell down right there. That's fine, we'll find him in a minute. Let's go ahead and crack open the final loot. I've been trying to go fast because we're such a disappointment. Running out of time here. I don't want that. To be able to turn in this quest. And I don't think we're going to be able to do it at this point. Ma'am. Great. Now my arm is sprained. Good. Excellent. Sprain all the things. So that's one zombie. We've got another one right over there. And we've got another one like way the crap out here. I don't even know what you're doing out here. You're just being difficult. I don't think we're going to be able to get back to the trader in time to turn in this quest. That is that is the mission right there. It is all done. So we can try and get back, but it's going to be really tight if so. I mean, I'm a little concerned about the time it's going to take to hop off the bike and run inside without leaving the bike so close that the trader decides to steal it for the evening because that's a thing. So let's make sure we hop off the bike on the street here. Okay, perfect. Now we've got at best 20-ish uh, minutes and at worst about another seven. So let's go ahead and go in here. Very quick decision of... God, all this stuff is garbage. Um, I'm just going to sell you everything and not even worry about it from here. I mean, generally, I'm just offended. Really. This is all just terrible stuff. Look at that. Just like I said, worst case scenario, about seven minutes. Drives me nuts when they close ten minutes early. Like, come on, man. What sort of crap customer service is that? Customer out here, I'm trying to spend money. And you're like, nope, get out, we're closing. But it's not even closing time. Well, we need time to sweep the store of patrons and turn off all the lights and all the things. Okay. You do whatever you need to do, good trader, sir, because goodness knows you're magical and can't be touched. We'll run one more quest to kind of round out the day, although before we do that, we'll check the gas pumps just to see if there's any cheap and easy fuel, which it doesn't seem like there is any so far, so you know, that's a shame. I really could have done with I don't know some extra free fuel, but alas it is what it is. Let's see if there's any free fuel this time. Hey, look at that. We got some this time. Excellent. Did stop back at the base to drop off everything and take uh, some meds and all that sort of stuff, so... Most everything's looking pretty good right now. Got a little bit of time left on the sprint... The sprint? The sprained leg. I was gonna say the splinted sprained leg. No. Didn't use any splints because I think they were all sprained, so that's not gonna do you any good anyway. So, no. Didn't do that. Just figured, oh well, run with it so to speak. Get it? 
Which one is it? That one. There you go. Yeah, there you go. Run with it on a sprained leg. Get it? Yeah, got it. Okay, good. Good. Glad we're on the same Thanks, page. That, that goose is always just interrupting at the wrong, wrong time. It is what it is. Hi, how you doing, good sir? <laughs> that was pretty cool there. I enjoyed that very much. Thank you for that, sir. That was great. I'm pretty sure there's no one behind us. It's just that dude. Oh man, that was good. That was good. Oh, we're thirsty. Uh, here, why don't we just go ahead and... Oh, no. Never mind. Eh, we'll find a drink somewhere. It's fine. Not worried about it. Maybe. Possibly. I mean, there should be something up in the store here, and if not, we'll find some dirty water to drink or something. I don't... Oh, that was something I meant to do. I noticed that the hood needs to be repaired, along with most everything else. Meant to do it. Totally forgot. Just basically grabbed things and ran, so, or dropped off things and ran. Whatever, either way. What do we have on that one? So we can drink some nasty stuff if we need to. That's good to know. But I don't think it'll be necessary. And there you go. Perfect. We'll just drink that water and we'll be fine. Sure, take the beans, whatever. They're, they're fine. So it looks like this is the way to go next. I don't remember this POI very well, but fairly easy to follow. How you doing? I have expected a dog to be out here or something, but I guess not. That's cool. It doesn't look like there are any zombies in there. And I don't really want to drink toilet water, so... No! I mean, it's just a pile of bodies. That's pretty cool. Well, come on out. I want to add to the pile. <laughs> uh, good times. We're not had by the zombies there. Not at all. I've definitely added a bunch of time to that sprain. It was at like two minutes when we got here. Now it's up to almost five minutes. Didn't mean to grab all that. That's fine. It's because I just can't help myself. I gotta sprint everywhere I go. Yeah, sure, just use that. No one cares. It's not gonna do much, but it'll do something. Look at me not sprinting. It's impressive, isn't it? It's a thing of beauty. Sure, we'll take the sham. Let's go on upstairs. And then we'll check under the stairs first. Oh, it's so slow. I can feel my lifeblood slipping away as I very, very slowly climb up here. Okay, perfect. Man, the game is really hooking us up with arrows. I think before we left the base to start this video and go on a rescue mission, on a bit of a rescue ride, I believe I made a bunch of arrows, arrow heads, and then realized don't have any feathers. No feathers means no arrows. Really wasn't thinking that one through when I did that. Really wasn't. That's okay, though. Nope. Well, I just sprinted. Probably added 12 seconds back to it by sprinting. It's fine. Some days you just aren't thinking and, you know, you're you're not thinking with your thinker. You're thinking with your... I don't know, I don't know what you're thinking with. Thinking with your butt, I guess. I mean... Can't use it, because it's not a break. It's a sprain, which means someone has got to very slowly walk wherever they go. Although this is all going to fall apart. So, 
Sprint away, my pretty. Sprint away. Come on over here, buddy. I got something for you. And go! I don't know that I can play this game vanilla anymore with... Let me rephrase that. I don't know that I can play this game with the vanilla spear anymore. The whole point of the mod was to make stuff for the bow. And yet... The spear might be my favorite thing, which... is just kind of weird, but it is what it is. Oh, uh, this is a fetch hand to clear? Totally forgot about that. Okay. Well, worry about that next time, or later. And it's almost four o'clock, so here, let's let's finish this guy up. Let's just see if we can blast through the re remaining zombies. Easy for me to say. That is not all of them, though. Where are the last ones? I guess I missed the correct path. Oh, it's over here. Okay. That's fine. Oops a daisy. I think this spear specifically might even be my favoritist. It's just so good. Might be too good. Pretty sure I've mentioned that. I don't remember if there's anything in there. Yeah, hidden stash. I was gonna say. Ah. Okay. All these things are falling apart here. Let's go ahead and climb out. Or crawl out, I guess. Bad dog. Bad, bad zombie. Okay, so the area is clear. Just need to unlock the box and then go find the stash. Here, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and bust... Um, nope. I'm just going to go ahead and bust through the lock. There's the morning o'clock stinger. Kind of a shame. Kind of missed it. Oh, I totally forgot. There were things we're supposed to do, I think, back at the base. Uh, sure, take all those things, I guess. I don't know. I mean, I guess. I don't know. Here, take the things. Well, it'll have to be for next time. Well, that's not bad right there, although... I really, I didn't want... I don't want that. I'm trying to be better about not taking that stuff. Three, two, one, and now I can sprint. Thank goodness. Okay, so let's get back inside. And just complete the... Um, whatever portion of this quest, since... Totally, I ran, um, I passed the thing. It's like literally right here. I sure take all those things. Where is it? It's right up here, maybe. Is it up in the drop ceiling? It's in the wall. Uh, is this going to be a pain to get into? I know, get out of the way. Oh, goodness, it is. Where is it, then? Uh, brr, what? Yeah, let's get through the door. Might be on the other side. Oh, sure, just do it again. Yeah, it's behind here. I honestly just totally spaced on it being a fetch quest. I was just seeing clear and like, yeah, let's go just kill some zombies. Kind of look good. I'm gonna go drop some stuff off back at base, I guess. Resupply, I don't know. I'm gonna go do a thing. I'm gonna go prepare to do other things back at the base, because there's something that, if I remember to do it, it's going to be awesome. Catch you next one, Till, and thanks for watching. See you later.